So we're down at Africa Fashion Week 2019 and we're with one of the amazing designers, Mary Martin London. How are you doing? I'm fine, thank you. Very excited, looking forward to the show. She was like, listen, you need to see my new collection. And we were like, listen, we know about you already. So thank you for joining us. Yes, thank yeah. you. So as Hillary mentioned, we do know about you already. This is not your first Africa Fashion Week. Why is this event so important to you? Um, because this is the um, only event which... Um, profiles black designers as far as I'm concerned yeah your new collection though is quite exciting yeah. what was the idea and the inspiration behind it all right first is the first time I've ever done a man's collection <laughs> it was really really hard and <coughs> the collection is a 400 years anniversary of slave and basically um, it's called blood sweat and tears and the prints I've done a slave is called slave in the trees so I've got these prints which I um, printed myself on, on the backs and the fronts of the clothes and there's the slaves looking through the trees so it's like just a salute to the slaves. Mm. If it wasn't for them I wouldn't be here to tell my story. I was, I was about to say I mean it's a very controversial issue but yeah. you know how many other collections do you are you expected to kind of see promoting or at least celebrating that today? Well last time if you remember I did the Hidden Queen collection with all the black faces of us black women under the clothes the Hidden Queens with the veils on the top so I thought this year why not celebrate this um, the anniversary of the slaves because the reason why is because they celebrate St. Christopher, they celebrate Christmas. So I'm celebrating my ancestors because if it wasn't for them, I wouldn't be here. I love that. I love that. Now, obviously, what African Fashion Week is huge, it's gone from strength to strength. But what do you think is the next step for the event? Oh, the next step for the event is to um, maybe do it twice a year, like okay. the Fashion Week, okay. yes. um, February, September, do it twice a year, spring, autumn, just, well, there's no spring, autumn in Africa, but <laughs> spring, autumn in London, just bring on as many designers as you can that you, can f that you find. And by the way, I graduated three weeks ago. Um, yeah, I wasn't in the, um, the Graduate Fashion Week, but um, what I found in the university, it was really hard. Yeah very very hard and I have to like say I have to look out for your own um, you know black designers because I don't think they cater for us I really don't think they cater for us I mean I'm really really lucky that people like my designs genuinely but I work really really hard and I suffered in that university to get to where I am but I just thank God I mean, you've seen the designers, you know what the designers are going to be here today. Mm. Who are you most looking forward to, to kind of seeing their stuff this year? Well, I wanted to see Cebu, <laughs> but Cebu was yesterday, so I've missed him. Okay. I'm not sure who's here today, what designers are here today, but I just say that good luck to all of them. Something's yeah. good. Everybody's, what I've seen at the back, everybody's bought some beautiful, everybody's bought something different um, and unique, and everybody's bought... Um, great stuff they're from all over Africa they all, they've come from all over Africa they're bringing all new looks for people over here to have a look to get influenced by and I hope that it's just gonna rock and it's gonna kick off tonight I love it. I've got a final question for you what advice would you give to someone who an African designer who'd like to follow in your footsteps I would say don't listen to anybody if you feel like you've got it and you feel like you're in love with what you've got just follow your dream I follow God, I let God lead my path, God is the main important thing in my life. When people ask me where do you get inspired from, I say it's God and whether they believe me or not that's up to them but I walk with God and I let him lead my path and if he says Mary I open the door for you I know I'm going in crashing down. Love that, love that, yeah. love that, love that. <laughs> Iconic, I mean you know for the younger designers coming up you know they what would you say perhaps um, they should check out you know what's the most central piece of this particular collection that you've got here today you know what would you say? <coughs> That's, that's the standout piece of, all, of the whole collection. Well, to be honest with you, and I'm very modest, yeah. um, I believe that God has blessed me with my, my collection with the men. I didn't think I'd be able to do it because I've never done men's before. But um, my collection, I brought a new dimension for men. It's like a new dimension for men. Um, I'm trying to get rid of all the old boring clothes that men always wear. I'm trying to spice up, spice up the men's life. Give it a bit of man spice. Give it a bit of man spice. And the reaction I've had from them young models backstage for my clothes, it's good. It's good. I'm, 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 I'm happy. I'm very happy. And I hope it just rocks on the catwalk. Brilliant.
Really? That's what we're talking about. Oh, I've about. got one. Oh, actually, I've got one ladies' dress. Yeah. I've got one ladies' dress in my collection because it's the anniversary of the slaves. Yeah. The reason I've got the lady um, dressed in the one dress because she's the mother of all these boys. And that's Amazing. the story. Amazing. And, 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 and we also say Mother Africa, don't Mother we? Mother Africa. So, and, representing. And the thing is, Adia, the model, Adia, she's from um, Congo. And she modeled for me last year. She came out dancing, remember? She came out dancing like a genie in the lamp. So this year she's going to rock it again for me. And also, I've got this um, track. It was from this, this um, Afri Nigerian artist, okay. Deja Vu. Okay. Okay. And he's done this track. Do you know him? No, I don't. But he's done this don't. track and he had my name in it. So I'm using oh, that on the catwalk. Oh, yeah. Okay. I'm using that on the catwalk tell, today. Tell him he's got a new fan. <laughs> Are we yeah. all ready to go and watch that? Absolutely. Yeah. So African Fashion Week 2019. We're coming. We're here to rock. Ready to go, keep it.